The aircraft classification number is a number expressing the relative effect of an aircraft on the runway pavement for a specified standard subgrade category, using a method defined by the International Civil Aviation Organization. The ACN is a single unique number expressing the relative effect of an aircraft on a pavement for a specified subgrade strength specifying a particular pavement thickness. It consists of a number on a continuous scale, ranging from zero on the lower end and with no upper limit, that is computed between two pavement types, and the subgrade support strength category. ACN values for civil aircraft have been published in ECO Euro Unregistered Trademark S Aerodrome Design Manual and in FAA Circular 155335-5. Using the ACN method, it is possible to express the effect of individual aircraft on different pavements by a single unique number, which varies according to pavement type and subgrade strength, without specifying a particular pavement thickness. The ACN is twice the derived single wheel load expressed in thousands of kilograms, with single wheel tire pressure standardized at 1.25 MPa. Additionally, the derived single wheel load is a function of the subgrade strength. The ACN of an airplane is a function of not only its weight but also the design parameters of its landing gear such as the distances between the wheels of a multiple wheel landing gear assembly. The Pavimenta Euro Unregistered Trademark S strength is denoted by its pavement classification number. The load exerted on a pavement by the landing gear of an airplane is denoted as its ACN, or airplane classification number. The ACN is not permitted to exceed the PCN of the runway to be used, in order to prolong pavement life and prevent possible pavement damage. The ACN is defined for only four subgrade categories. The ACN PCN method the ACN-PCN system of rating airport pavements is designated by the International Civil Aviation Organization as the only approved method for reporting strength. A Euro OE the bearing strength of a pavement intended for aircraft of apron mass greater than 5700 kg shall be made available using the aircraft classification number a Euro pavement classification number ACN PCN method a Euro 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 the ICAO system for civil airport pavements involves comparison of an airport a Euro unregistered trademark S pavement classification number with an aircraft classification number. According to this worldwide ICAO standard, Aircraft can safely operate on a pavement if their ACN is less than or equal to the pavement load bearing capacity or PCN. An aircraft having an ACN equal to or less than the PCN can operate without weight restrictions on a pavement. The PCN is formally published in an aeronautical information publication. States are required to evaluate and publish the strength of airport pavements using ICAO's ACN PCN system. The method concentrates on classifying the relative damage of aircraft. ICAO foresees that each pavement authority will define a PCN by whatever means is considered suitable to indicate the support level of a particular pavement such that all aircraft with a published ACN equal to or less than the reported PCN can use that pavement safely, without load-bearing failure or undue damage to the structure. The ACN-PCN system provides a standardized international airplane pavement rating system replacing the various S, T, TT, LCN, AUW, ISWL, etc., rating systems throughout the world. In 1981 ICAO promulgated the ACN-PCN method as the single universal system for determining the weight limitation of aircraft operating on airport pavements by a procedure of comparing an airport a Euro unregistered trademark SPCN with an ACN. To avoid accelerated deterioration and excessive maintenance costs and for the safeguarding of pavement integrity and assurance of optimum service life ICAO utilizes the ACN slash PCN load classification method for reporting pavement strength. According to this worldwide standard, aircraft can safely operate on a pavement if their ACN is less than or equal to the pavement load bearing capacity or PCN. An aircraft having an ACN equal to or less than the PCN can operate without weight restrictions on a pavement. The ACN-PCN method is not a design or evaluation method, but purely a classification system. 
Unfortunately the fact that the method of calculating ACN utilizes two common design and analysis methods has led a surprisingly large number of people to assume that it is a design and evaluation method. It is not uncommon for reference to be made to PCNA Euro unregistered trademark S calculated by the ACN PCN method. In fact the ICAO documentation makes it very clear that it is not a design evaluation method and that the PCN is simply the ACN of the most damaging aircraft that can use the pavement on a regular basis. The ACN PCN method only deals with aircraft weighting in excess of 5,700 kg as the airports with pavement for smaller size aircraft need only report the maximum allowable mass and the maximum allowable tire pressure if applicable. The ACN PCN system ensures that both aircraft and pavement can be utilized to their maximum extent without detrimental effects. According to the design manual the method is meant only for publication of pavement strength data in the aeronautical information publication. It is not intended for design or evaluation of pavements, nor does it contemplate the use of a specific method by the airport authority either for the design or evaluation of pavements. Although the design manual states that any method may be used to determine the load rating of the pavements, it is obvious that the use of layered elastic method in conjunction with calibrated failure criteria is preferred. ACN reporting, ACN values for selected aircraft have been calculated by the International Civil Aviation Organization using two computer programs, one for rigid pavements and the other for flexible pavements. Manufacturers are required to calculate ACNs for new aircraft as they come into service and publish the results in flight manuals. The tables give ACN values for two weights, one at the maximum total weight authorized and the other at the operating weight when empty. If an aircraft is operating at an intermediate weight, the ACN value can be calculated by a linear variation between the limits. Extrapolation is not permissible. ACN is calculated with respect to the center of gravity position, which yields the critical loading on the critical gear. Normally, the aftmost center of gravity, or CG position, appropriate to the maximum gross apron mass, or ramp weight, is used to calculate the ACN. In exceptional cases, the forwardmost CG position may make the nose landing gear loading more critical. The ICAO Aerodrome Design Manual a Euro Part 3 a Euro Appendix 2 contains computer programs for the calculation of ICAO ACNs for aircraft operation on both rigid and flexible pavements. The ICAO ACN for trans source code has been rewritten and recompiled by Transport Canada into two executable standalone programs. The original input output formats of the ICAO ACN programs were followed as closely as possible. The internal program calculations and equations of the ICAO programs were also followed and incorporated in the new X files. The result is the computation of aircraft ACN values that are fully compatible with the ICAO ACN PCN strength reporting system for airfield pavements. The programs are available at http slash software htm. The FAA also has a large amount of guidance material available on their website. Advisory Circular AC 155335-5B provides further guidance on ACN and PCN calculations and the relationship between the two numbers. The FAA also provides a more user-friendly version of the ICAO computer programs, although that code has been translated from the original Fortran language to Visual Basic. The FAA software is Comfort and is available from their software download page at http tc 4 gov download index one aspsoft Subgrade Support Strength Category The ranges of subgrade strength covered by these standard subgrade categories are shown below. Equals Flexible Pavements equals The flexible pavements have four subgrade categories A. High Strength for Euro CBR 15. B medium strength for Euro CBR 10. C low strength for Euro CBR 6. D ultra low strength for Euro CBR 3. Equals rigid pavements equals, the rigid pavements have four subgrade categories, A. High strength for Euro subgrade K equals 150 mnm 3. B medium strength for Euro K equals 80 mnm 3. 
See low strength a euro k equals 40 mnm3. D ultra low strength a euro k equals 20 mnm3. Updates, as per October 2007, ICAO revised the alpha factor for four-wheel undercarriages. Based on recent findings of full-scale pavement tests, ICAO agreed to the following revisions concerning the alpha factor values, a. Change the alpha factor value for all four wheels per main landing gear from the current 0.825 to 0.80. b. Retain the alpha factor for six wheels per main landing gear at 0.72. And c. Change the alpha factors for other main landing gears so that the ranking of the damaging effect remains consistent. Aircraft ACN list